Hello and welcome back to my series of Ultima 4, doing a complete playthrough of this game. As you can see, we are here right where we left off last time, here near the town of Moonglow. And we are going to uh, start our gameplay today by, uh, at first, let's go into the town and explore the town and, and, and see what is happening there. So um, I will, uh, everything here works on a text-based basis. So I will uh, type in an E and, and here for enter town. And you'll see now we are standing at the gates of Moonglow. Yeah, you know, I've, I've gone through several different uh, uh, iterations of playing around with the starting bit of this game, and and I've never not started at Lord Britain's castle. So I don't I don't quite know what to make of this. I'm a little uh, confused, but we are in Moonglow, and Moonglow is is interesting because it's on an island, um, on Verity Isle to be exact, uh, and. Uh, so yeah, we, we aren't even on the same, on the same, um, piece of land as Lord Britain's castle. So we'll have to get back there. We need to have that conversation, uh, for right now we can't do that. So let's look at the map. I'm not sure which aisle we're on. Um, I, I'm not sure if it's one of these bigger islands that are off to the, um, off on the eastern side of the map. Uh, there are some smaller items spread around. There's like, you know, uh, some of the south there just below the compass rows. Uh, we've got a few small ones. We got one uh, over there by the by the sea serpent thing in the um, uh, southwestern quadrant. Uh, and with some smaller ones due west, on, on the due west there. So I'm not quite sure where exactly we are right now. So we're going to explore the town of Moonglow. Uh, and explore our new character and see what's what. So let's get back to the game. So first of all, we're just barely in town. Uh, I'm going to do uh, the, the Zats. And let's look at what we are. So we're now a mage. We're level 2. Uh, we got a strength of 19, a dexterity of 22, and intelligence of 24. Uh, we've got 200 hit points. Um, and, uh, we've got a staff and we're wearing cloth. So much different, much different. So obviously I, I need to be dealing with the reagents, uh, that I went through on the, uh, that I talked about. And these are ways that you mix to make spells. Um, so, So yeah, let's uh, let's continue on. So as far as weapons, I just have my hands. Even though it says there I have a weapon of a staff, uh, maybe that's what's equipped. Is my hands? I don't have any armor. I've got two torches, zero gems, and zero keys. I don't have any items. I've got some ginseng and I've got some garlic. Okay, that's good to know. All right, let's be done with that. So. I'm going to need to be making some spells. So fireball um, requires black pearl and um, sulfurous ash. So I can't make that right now. I could make cure. So I could, with ginseng and garlic, I could make the cure spell, which would perfect, protect me if I get poisoned. Uh, so I don't know what to do that. Let's go in and let's check out Moonglow a little bit. Let's talk to this guy. This is a mage. You can tell by the staff. He is, he says, I am Calabrini. All right, what's your job? I bear greetings from the fair city of Moonglow. All right. Oh. Uh, yeah. Let's say yes. Which? Let's say an inn. We have an excellent inn. <laughs> okay. Um, market? Health? His health is fine. You want to join me? He cannot join me because we can add to our party here. All right. So let's take a look around here. We've got another mage here, a battered mage. Name, his name is Tyrone. 
What's your job, Tyrone? I used to search for the blue stone. The stone of honesty is found on an altar in the dungeon of deceit. All right. So that's something we probably need to take... Uh, we need to take some note of that the uh, Stone of Honesty is in the Dungeon of, seat, of Deceit. All right, important information, I think. Um, oh. Yes. Know its uses. Can't help us with that. Let's see if you can help us with dungeon. Deceit. I don't think I'm spelling that right. There we go. Nope. Okay. Um, so search. Stone. He just says the same thing over and over again. Okay. Um, yes. No, it's uses. Would he join our party? Can't join our party. Okay. Goodbye. It's interesting that our avatar does not change. We still have that kind of avatar. So here we are at the inn. If we needed to uh, get a room, we could do that here. We don't really need that right now. Let's talk to this guy. He says, I am Reb Re Rebelas, I guess. I live an honest life. Apparently, I'm feeling like this is a town of honesty. You know, I'm getting that sense that honesty lives here. Uh, speak the truth and shame the evil forces. Truth. Join. I would very much like to be able to add to my party so it's not just me because we will be fighting really, really soon. All right, goodbye. Let's talk to this guy. This guy's a fighter. A regal paladin. What's your name, Regal Paladin? He is Cromwell. Job. I speak of the virtues of honesty. Of course you do. You're here. So what can you tell me about honesty? A few honest men are better than numbers. Okay. Dost thou strive to be honest? I will say yes. You will need the mantra. Oh, we need a mantra for honesty. The mantra for the shrine of honesty is Aum. I'm going to write that down too. Okay. Maybe he can tell us something about where the shrine is at. Shrine. Cannot. All right, you want to join us? I can spell. He cannot join us. That is sad. Well, thank you for the information. That was very, very helpful. I don't think I necessarily want to talk to um, the innkeeper at this point. An elderly woman. What is your name, elderly woman? I am Kosama. What's your job? An alchemist. I know how best to mix reagents. Dost thou know how to best mix spells? Let's say no. I'm a, I'm a wet under the ears mage. The secrets in the reagents. What are the reagents? A soup spell actually requires but one part spider silk. Oh, interesting. So if I want to do... Ask her about various spells. Is she going to tell me? Oh, okay. I guess not. All right. Cannot join me. Okay, well, thank you. Thank you for the information. 
so what do we have here? We have the Sage Deli. So if I talk to this guy, welcome to the Sage Deli. Good day and welcome, friend. May I interest you in some rations? Rations. Uh, we have the best adventure rations, 25 for only 25 gold pieces. How many packs of 25 would you like? Now, we're at three in our food, which I think is our maximum. So uh, I'm not going to buy any right now. But if I needed to buy more, this is where I'd buy it. We've got a child here. This is the uh, icon for a child. You meet a child in eating a sandwich. What is your name? I am William. What's your job? Oh, not much. Sandwich. It's a peanut butter and grape jelly on lightly toasted bread. Mm. Would thou like a bite? Sure, why not? Yummy, huh? So I got to eat a bite of the kid's sandwich. I cannot join thee. That would have been a little weird anyway. <laughs> Traveler comes in, takes the kid on a quest. Sounds like a bad movie. So here's a healer. If I needed to be uh, healed, which I currently don't. Um, she says, oh, I'm a dying wizard. I'm apprentice to the great wizard Nigel. I will soon need to use the spells he spell he calls recall. Hast thou met Nigel? No, I have not. He lives at the Lyceum. Okay, at the Lyceum. So Nigel lives at a Lyceum. A E U M. So that might be somebody to uh, to talk to at some point. Let's see if he's got anything to tell us about the Lyceum. Can I help you with that? Probably doesn't want to join us because he's dying. Health. I will soon die. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what dying means. All right, so we don't need to be, be healed necessarily. I suppose we can talk to him real quick. Welcome to the healer, Harmony says. Peace and joy be with you. Are you in need of help? Uh, may thy life be guarded by the powers of good. So if I was to say to her, yes, oops, I got a choice of curing, healing, or resurrection. So I don't need any of those right now. Um, I don't know how much it costs. I guess we'll find out when I need them. Uh, let's talk to this person. Not a mage. An old gypsy. She says, I am Anu. All right, what is your job, Anu? I am a fortune teller. I read palms. Palms? Palms tell fortunes. Fortunes, give thy palm. Dost thou wish thou destiny? Sure, let's see what she's got to say. A great quest will lead thee into the abyss where the codex awaits. Okay, wow, that's for foreshadowing there. Let's see if she's got information about the about the, the codex. How about the abyss? How about the quest? Nope. Can you join? Nope, I didn't think so. All right. Let's see what else is here. Magical herbs. Okay, now we're talking. Let's talk to this guy. Oh, or gal. Me, you meet a wise wizard. What's the name? I am Shakespeare. Interesting name for a wizard. Job. I create tales of honesty. Okay. You can't tell me about tales. Honesty. Remember, there is no terror in threats, for I am strong in honesty. Okay. Dost thou strive to be honest? Yes. Beware corruption. Okay. You cannot join me. Of course you can. Thank you. Goodbye. How about you? What's your name? I am Browning. I strive to live an honest life. 
life. Honest. An honest soul need remember no lies. Hast thou never lied? Well, not as this character I haven't. Truth never hurts the teller. Cannot join me. Okay. Uh, I think I'm done talking to you, too. Let's talk to the uh, purveyor of magical herbs here. I am Margo. Are you in need of reagents? Well, I have sulfurous acids and garlic, spider silk, black blood moss, and black pearl. Hmm. Well, let's see. Sulfurous acid will probably come in handy. Let's grab... What is it I need to make fireball? Because I, I, need, I need something that's... Um, that requires black pearl and sulfurous ash. So these are two gold pieces each. I got 200 gold. Hmm. Let's buy five to start with. Yes. Uh, I need some black pearl. Black pearl for nine gold pieces. How many would you like? Let's get ten, I guess. Anything else? Yes. Let's get another. Oops. Surface ash. Let's get another five. Pay ten. Yes. Uh, spider silk. Let's get four spider silk. Oh, interesting. You can haggle. Uh, interesting. Basically. Uh, blood moths. Blood moths. I don't remember what that's for. Six gold. Ooh, that's expensive. Uh, let's buy a couple of those. Say I'm willing to pay 10 for that. Oh, okay. I'm assuming if I got low enough, if I did like one gold piece, that they, they would go, nope, you, you, you can't do that. <laughs> All right, so we've got a bunch of reagents now. So I could mix things. Mix for spell. Let's say cure. Whoops. Reagent. Oh. So reagent for cure is ginseng and garlic. Okay, so you can see I've got one cure. So... So I could mix fireball. So the fireball, so what I need to do is is A and F. So I've got a fireball. So I could mix another fireball, A and F. And then I could do another fireball. Isn't this riveting? Do one more fireball. Okay, so we got cure and we got fireball. I think maybe that will be enough for now. Kind of the important thing. Spider silk and blood moss can be used to construct a blink spell. Maybe we'll do that. Blink. So we need, what did I say, spider silk and blood moss. Success! So we've got a blink spell, we got a cure spell, and we got four fireball spells. We'll let that be for now. Okay, let's get back to exploring here. So we've been to all the shops, I think. But there are some things that can be found outside of the buildings. So let's kind of go through the, like this guy, he's a shepherd, a meek shepherd. What is your job? I am shepherd, so you have no name. How's your health? Pretty good. Can you join? Can I join? 
kind of an odd seeing a shepherd here in this town of mages. All right, you're of no use whatsoever. Now, if I go too far out of town here, I will actually leave town and be back in the wilderness. Um, and I don't necessarily want to do that. I talked to her already. But let's look around. Oh, look at here. Who are you? It's got a chest. A young mage. Name. I am Uriah. Job. I seek adventure. Ooh. This might be somebody that can join me. Yes, I hope to go on a great quest. Art thou on a quest? Well, as a matter of fact, I am. I wish I could join thee. Well, maybe you could. Let's try it. I cannot join thee. Ah! Chest? Can't tell me about that. Come on! She, like, took the interview for joining my quest. And then when I offered her the job, she's like, Nah, dude. <laughs> Not interested. <laughs> uh, well, let's see if this chest is right here. And, and she didn't say anything about it. If I uh, get the chest. Oh, you can see that I, it was an acid trap. I got some more gold, which is good because I just spent a ton of it. You can see that I, I uh, the acid trap did cause me a little bit of damage. Caused me one hit point. That's not too bad right now. I'm not too worried about that. So that was interesting. We got a jester here. Let's talk to the jester. I am Decker. I hope to earn a law, an honest living jesting. It's only like jousting. I love a good jest. Dost thou? Sure, I'm a fun loving guy. We ought to exchange jokes sometime. Jokes. Join. It would be my luck that this is the guy that can join me. <sighs> Cannot join me. I think there's supposed to be somebody at pretty much everything that's supposed to be able to uh, join me. But I I'm, not, I'm not doing very well here. So I meet an insane looking man. I am Derenor. Well, what's your job, insane guy? He turns away. Wow, he's not very nice. Your interest. I move the sun. Yeah, he's insane. The moons are my enemies. When I die, the world will end. Well, well for you. So you're not incorrect, necessarily. Do you believe my story? Uh, you should always honor uh, or humor the insane. So I will say yes. Then we must fell the moons. <laughs> okay. Ooh, bye. Oh, I should ask him. Why not? Can you join? Oh, good. He turned away. <laughs> I was scared he's going to want to come with me. I'm not so sure I'm happy about that. So let's walk around the perimeter here because sometimes there was interesting stuff on the perimeter. I talked to him. You can see that you know, this is like shrubberies or something here, and so it's sometimes slower progress. So we've got we've gone around the whole perimeter there. there we got they got a little a little lake. Look at them with their little lake. That's the guy I just talked to, the insane guy. And that's the that's the, the, the maids that wants to go on adventure, any adventure but mine. So there's nobody here to join us. We've got some spells. Alright, I think we've done everything we can do here in the town of Moonglow. So let's get uh, looking around a bit. I'm gonna do a quick save just because I can. And uh, I need to, I'm hoping I can figure out where in the map we are. We've got this bridge, and we've got some marshland. And if we look at, we kind of got two peninsulas here. Oh, there's a moon gate. Oh, dear me. Let us, if I can hurry up. We went somewhere else. <laughs> Somewhere else with the moon gate. So let's take a, uh, actually, let's get in this town. 
and we're in Yehom. Yehom. All right, let's take a look at the map now that we're we're someplace safe. So, I believe we were on this big island over here that was to the uh, east of the Ultima Four logo because we've got the two little peninsulas uh, on the south side and there's a moon gate there. Now, as far as where we are now, um, we would have to go back and see uh, see what our, our, our surroundings looks like. Um, and let's go ahead and do that just for chuckles. So I'm gonna go back outside and we're in a on an island that's got Oops, I am not. Sorry about that. Oh, there's the moon gate. I, still. That went away. Okay. So we've got, we're an island that's got a lot of marshland. It's got uh, some mountains here that we can't, um, that we can't uh, cross. And we don't, the, the, this area here that's got the blue, the blue and the green dots, this is marshland. It will poison me if I go there. So I don't really want to go there necessarily. Although I do have Cure Spell. Uh, and I can always mix up some more. There's really not that many places you can go here without going through the march. Let's go into town for a minute. And let's, let's look around at, at the town. We got a lot of guards. I am a guard. Do you have a name? I am a guard. What do you guard? Can I help me? Yeah, talking to guards is usually pretty worthless. Let's go into town here. Let's let's like talk to this guy. You meet a thin fighter. What is your name, thin fighter? He is Timrod. What's your job? I fight with valor. Oh, this must be the town of valor. Must be the town of Valor. Uh, he cannot fight. Or he cannot help us with, with, with uh, the fight. Well, how about Valor? Holier, there is no holier spot of ground than where defeated Valor lies. Art thou brave? Well, of course I am. Fortune helps the brave. Fortune? Nope. Can you join? Cannot join me. Nobody wants to join me. I must not have worn my deodorant today or something. So let's see what's up here. We've got healing. Don't really need healing. I'm only down one hit point. I'm not too fussed about it. You meet a strange person. Says, I am X. What's your job, X? I seek the stone. What stone is that? The red stone. Red is for valor, a virtue of the avatar. Art thou an avatar? I guess so. That's why I got the onk, I think. Wow! <laughs> While you're so impressed, you want to join me? You cannot join me. All right. We got armor. We got weapons. Now, as a mage, I don't know if I can I'll go back to my zats for a minute here. Weapon staff, I could probably maybe wear some armor. I don't have a lot of gold, though. Let's see. I want to buy. We've got chain mail, plate mail, magic chain, magic plate. So how much would the, the lowest of the low be? Oh, apparently I only have enough money for basic plate, for basic chain mail, so... All right, and I don't know that I need any weapons. Buy, say, active swords. Hmm. Fare thee well. All right, let's talk to these guys who are just kind of hanging out here. I am Sir William, ooh, a knight. In search for valiant fighters. Art thou violent? Valiant? Yeah, I'm valiant. Valiant. Streak ye to defeat all evil. Kill not non evil creatures, but still always stand thy ground. 
I cannot join thee. Okay, of course you can. All right, let's go talk to this guy. Oh, which one's the guy? Sir Hrothgar. What's your job, Hrothgar? I fight for valor. The valiant fears not its own visage. Visage. Art thou the most valiant of souls? Sure I am. This is not likely. Oh, burn. Oh, uh, man. Can I join me? Because now he thinks I'm... That's X. Yeah, okay, we talked to X. All right, let's move on. Let's move on. What do we have here? We got the inn, and we have the pub. Well, let's talk to some people at the pub. Ooh, a five-foot pregnant woman. I am Lady Donna. What's your job? Probably having that kid. I watch over my sheep. I can't stand sheep. <laughs> okay, join? Uh, it makes sense. You're, you're pregnant. <laughs> All right. A grave fighter. What's your name, friend? I am Gravnor. Okay, what's your job? I search the dungeons. I seek the red stone. It is found on an altar. Okay. Dost thou have it? I do not have it. It lies in the dungeon distard. So the red stone red stone valor is in dungeon distard. Okay. Can you join me? Whoops. Can you join me? I cannot join thee. All right, goodbye. Let's see what we can get at the pub. Welcome to the bloody pub, Sestral says. Where will it be? Food or ale? Well, let's get some food. Our specialty is dragon tartare, which costs two gold. How many plates would you like? Oh, let's get, th let's see, so three. Okay. Yes, ale. Mug of our best. That'll be two gold pieces. You'll pay? Oh, I, you pay. I'll pay him as two. Well, I had some nice, nice ale. See you, mate. All right. Let's keep looking around. Who are you? Have I talked to you? A ranger with a faraway look. Hi, friend. What's your name? I am Luke. Okay, what's your job around here, Luke? I seek the inner light. I come from Scarabray, and I'm on my way to you. Hast thou been to Scarabray? And I will say, nope. Tis a spiritual city. Spiritual city. Nope. Join? Can I join me? All right. Goodbye. Now, this is for the rooms in the inn. Yeah, yeah, these are the rooms in the inn. Let's talk to this, this character since he's outside the room. I am Max. Oh, a housekeeper. Job, housekeeper. Yep, yep, yep. Um, might need somebody to, you know, tuck in my bedroll in the morning or something, so... Housekeeper might be interesting to take on a quest. All right, is that like all the shops here? Looks kind of that way. You guys are just annoying me. Healing area. Uh, sleep. Or dead. I am Bengra. What's your job? Besides being sick. I search the dungeons. I'm guessing he's searching for the redstone. I fell in the dungeon to starred. Hast thou found its altar room? No, nope, not yet. I found the dungeon. 
Find it! Okay, thank you very much. Yeah, I, I didn't think so because you're still laying there going bleh. Alright, let's see what else is in this town. We got lots of heavy woods in here. But there's nothing going on there. It's down here. Because sometimes in these dark, shadowy corners. Ah, a warrior named S Slythe? What's your job, Slythe? I fight battles. True valor is seen not in the force of arms, but in the force of will. Art thou valiant? Yes, I am. Then never flee unless the need is dire. Join? <sighs> Come on, I'm tired of being a party of one here. I need one of you guys to step up and join my team, man. All right, let's see what's going on here. Hey, look at you. Meet a small man. What's your name, friend? I am Aesop. Okay, what's your job? I search for valor. Valor? I find it's as easy to be brave from a safe distance. <laughs> know what I mean? Sure, why not? That's my problem. Join? He won't join me because he's too chicken. All right, what else is there here? Nothing? What about on the outer edges of here? Nope. Nothing. Okay. Ah, uh, dear me. So, if we go back to the map and try to look at islands that have moon gates, there's really only two. You've got the small ones in the far west, right in the center. And then you've got the one, the large one, that's just to the uh, east of the Ultima 4 logo. So I am guessing that uh, there was the moon gate again. And I must have. So I'm guessing we might be on that small island in the far west. And um, I think I'm going to need to mix some more cure spells. So let's do some... Uh, ginseng and garlic. All right, that'll be good for now, I think, because I think I need to go. I need to go on this um, marshland to try to see where I am, and probably get. Yeah, so you see, I'm poisoned now. Yeah, there's really not very to do here. This is like a little backwater place. So let's cure myself. So I'm going to cast a spell cure on myself. So there we go. Now one thing I could do here is I could hole up and camp. And this will allow me to sleep. As you can see I'm sleeping. I've got some food on a spit. And when I wake up I should have my full health except that I am getting uh, attacked by something. Gizmo Staff, Cast, Spell, Fireball, Direction, East. Took care of it. Got eight experience. That was an Etten. Excellent. Oh, I got an Orc. Cast, Fireball. I'm not liking this island. Let's try to hole up in camp again. Let me sleep. <laughs> just, just, I'm just a guy trying to take a nap. I mean, is there really so much to ask? All right. So that's where we are. I think uh, I will end this here. And 
we will pick it up again next time. So I will be back uh, with another episode soon. Bye.